how to find safe, good deodorant. Guys, deodorant is something we all need, we all use. Anyone who's not using it, you know, you know what it's like. I mean, gosh, it's miserable being around the guys. So I set a little experiment. Actually, it wasn't even an experiment. I ran out of the regular good deodorant that I use. And by running out, I went back to the old stuff that I had. And I, I don't know 100% for sure if this is why it happened, but, but I got a rash under my arm right there going back to this old deodorant. Let me show you what I did. I have like a, basically a natural deodorant. It's very important to like use a natural deodorant. This is just made in coconut oil. I'm not an affiliate. I'm not trying to sell it. Uh, so, you know, don't buy it. But it's basically just make sure you whatever you do buy, it does not have aluminum in it. No aluminum. Uh, you know, no like pesticides. It should be non-GMO. It should just be made of like basically coconut oil and baking soda, sunflower oil, vitamin E, beeswax, good ingredients. This is, this is called pita paste. Pit paste, primal pit paste. I really like this stuff. I went back to the old stuff. It's called Old Spice Fresh High Endurance. Stuff gave me like a rash on my arm. I don't know if that, that's why I got the rash. It could have been from something else. could have been from waxing or something. But I mean, ultimately, this definitely irritated me. And a lot of these type of deodorants, they, they have aluminum in it. So you've got to avoid aluminum entirely. Imagine putting metal on your skin and it gets into your bloodstream. It's not good. It's not good at all. So be aware of what you're using in deodorant. And I highly recommend just going out and getting like something like baking soda, something simple, something basic, no aluminum in it. This one is a little more expensive. I got it on Amazon. You can, you can look into it. But something like this, not this one. I mean, it's worth it. All I do with this is I take uh, that, boy, I put a little on my finger right there and just like basically rub it on. You go like this. That's it. That's all it is, man. Simple, dude. Boom. Deodorant, bro. We all need it. We all have to have it. It's not really fun to talk about or anything, but it is what it is. You got to have it. If I don't have deodorant, I can tell, but I'm like a clean freak. I'm like aesthetic clean freak all the time. I have to be clean you know so if i don't have it i'm paranoid so i didn't have it so i had to use this waiting for this to come in i'm telling you it was no good so I don't go back to this old spice you need to clean up your act and get some like natural products i mean this is the best of their old spice because it doesn't have aluminum in it other kinds did but it still has like words i can't even pronounce which are basically chemicals basically all chemicals is what it is it's it, drugs and chemicals in here i don't even know what they are Long words I can't pronounce. The only thing I knew how to pronounce on here was green and violet and water. Everything else are too long. Fragrance. All right. Deodorant. What to buy, what to what to use. What deodorant do you use? Maybe you can like leave a comment below like if you recommend something else. It is something that is important. Because if you have the wrong type of deodorant, it will leak into your bloodstream. And it definitely can like cause a lot of buildup and, and more pollution inside the body and toxins inside the liver. So... That's it. Done. Leave a comment below with what you use. Subscribe down here. This is Gavin Mail coming at you.